All right. Welcome, welcome one and all to the next video. Today, we have a visitor, all right? I just came onto the server. I saw that apparently a visitor is approaching the base. So let us see who this visitor even is. 50 meters away, all right? The reason I'm at the mining base is because they ran out of food and everybody got sick and depressed and whatever. It's broken feet, legs, whatever. I was like, this is a disaster. So we heal them up. They're fine now. Oh, so the visitor is a wandering merchant. Yeah? Let's see. All right. Welcome. I've got some good items in stock. All right. Let's see. Are they good? This is the same shit that all of them have. This is not like, yeah, this is not even unique. <laughs> I mean, what we could do maybe, do we want to capture the wandering merchant? He's level one. I don't like capturing humans. No, we're not going to capture. Them. I feel like capturing humans in this game is kind of, your morals kind of all over the place. And by all over the place, I mean non-existent. So wandering merchant, we're going to leave you alone. All right. You could you you could stay there in your little corner until we leave. I think they did very good with the design though. They almost look they look like giant leprechauns almost. All right, <laughs> we need to make it back up there. I mean, we should have. weren't we supposed to have a van room? I feel like I specifically remember wanting a van room. We have one at the base. The thing is. Oh, we do have the Van Womb Saddle. That's what we needed the Flame Organs for. Now I remember. Now I remember. So we're going to bench actual Sadis. I believe he does transport, right? I feel like all the birds do transport. No, he does gathering. All right, you... I feel like you kind of worthless <laughs> at this point. I mean, he is level 25. He is one of our strongest pals, but like... And by he, I mean she. And... It's impossible for me to remember the genders of all these pals, all right? Just give me a break. So we could probably uh, take Van Worm, right? Yeah, I think so. The one thing is, first of all, we have to name him. him. Right. Who is going to replace Van Worm? Because Van Worm is level three transport. Do we have another one? No, we only caught one, didn't we? Yeah. Let's see. Who else will do transport? Dazzy. I don't think Dazzy could even pick up ore. I think you need a high enough level to even pick up the ores, you know? So instead... Alright, seriously? None of you? No? We have our shiny Mazarina, by the way. Uh, we have Lucky. Work speed plus 15%. The thing is, that doesn't actually affect the production of the milk. So it's not actually good. Oh, we have a new song that apparently... It's very quiet. Anyways, whatever. All right, let's just put somebody with level, I guess, level one transport. Ah, it's so annoying. None of them, none, none of them are good at transporting. Mm. Whatever. I guess we should try to capture a van room, right? Another one. All right, whatever. We'll put Dazzy here for now. It doesn't matter too much. Oh, you know, we have this rehound as well. We should have the Rehound at the other base. But yeah, we got so much ore from this base. I think we have like... I'll show you all. I'll show you all. Watch. Oh, this song is actually loud. Oops. All right. That should be better. I mean, you all... Again, you all aren't actually going to have these songs be that loud. So it's fine. Look, you see... Okay. In the patch notes, they said they fixed this. Oh, wait. They did. They're not, they're not stuck. All right. I was about to bitch about them being stuck on top of the pal box, but apparently they're fine. Okay. Yeah. So first of all, Jotog, you need to go. Cause he's only level one uh, electricity producing, whatever, generating electricity. Instead, we're going to put Rayhound. Cause he only, he only does generating electricity, right? That's what we want. We want him to only be there. Let's see. Right. So, look at how much ore we have. 789. That is insane. That's because I've been leaving the silver ore and I went and collected and I was like, holy shit, we actually have ingots now. So, maybe we don't need to worry too much about ingots. I'll take these, actually. We want to go and put that Van Womb saddle, right? Did we make the Van Womb saddle? I feel like we didn't. 
Yeah, the answer is no. All right, cool. Uh, we should. Do we need fried eggs? I feel like we don't, right? We can make more cakes. We have 62 cakes we can make. Yeah, we should probably just put those on to be made. Actually, is it a waste? Eh, whatever. I still haven't put... Oh, wait. We do have eggs. We have eggs. How long are these eggs going to take? Hmm. Large electric eggs. Okay, I have no idea what these are going to make. Anubis and Chillette. Yeah, because I didn't actually look it up. So... Let's see what at least see what we get from this common egg. We, all today we're gonna do today is exploring because we need to level up. We got a nightwing. It's meh. Oh, ten minutes on these eggs. Maybe at the end of the episode we might be able to hatch these. We'll see. All right. Anything else we need to do at the base at this point? Be like no, right? I don't. We don't need this. <laughs> Right, yeah, I still have the medical supplies just because I need to heal all the pals. Do we have a box in here? Yeah, good. Let's good. throw these in here. I'm thinking we just explore in a completely different area today. Oh, last thing we need, Van Womb Saddle. Van Womb Saddle, because we want to ride our Van Womb, right? So... We're lacking leather and fi How are we lacking fiber? And leather, leather, really? Huh. Alright, well, at this point, we might as well just go and get a leather. I don't even know what drops leather. Let's see. Because it tells you. So, fox pox. Okay. We should have... Do we not have anybody doing watering? What is this? Why is there nobody doing watering? Oh... It's because we remove. Wait, no. Where where is horse boy? Not even. Oh. I need you to go and make this fiber. <laughs> I like like you pick him up, and he is so big. They somehow made it work, though. I appreciate that they actually made it work. Assigned to copper ore. Where are you going? Come back. No, he's eaten. Alright, whatever. Maybe he'll eventually go and make it. Alright, in the meantime... We'll probably just explore and just kill stuff and we'll probably get a fiber from whatever. So I don't think we should worry too much about it. We just don't have a flying pal. By the way, we, what do we want to name Van Worm? He's... He's a firebird. Hmm. I don't... I don't know... We need to find a good name for Van Womb, though. I feel like... We had to think about it. We had to think about it. All right. Remember, too, we have our Mama Rest, our Battle Beast. Uh, so fucking sick. Excuse me. Definitely need to... Use him to destroy literally everything that we see. All right, cool. Well, for now, we'll just go. Oh, this song. This song is... I hate this song. I have to remove it. Okay, where we want to go? We could go north of here, maybe? Or maybe here. Look, we have no idea. Like, what is here? All right, let's go here. Island Hopper Coast. I feel like this song is too quiet, too. All right, it's good now. Do we get... Do we even have rubies? I feel like we don't, right? This will be difficult. Oh, all we need to do is shoot them, actually. And then they should all just come. Right, and then you... I, w I want them to come into one area first. Battle Beast, no! Look at that. <laughs> Wait, how did you not get hit? Alright. Oh yeah, nice. They dropped leather. Grass Tornado! Alright. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. <laughs> These poor rubies. Wait, we're supposed to be captur capturing them, aren't we? Alright, well, I forgot. Maybe we could use um, Longboy Drake, you know why? Because he might hit. Yeah. That's what I was hoping for, like, hit them just enough for them to be low. Alright, we should capture the two of them here, right? 
Are you gonna stand your pals fair? Nice, you gotta stand your pals fair. There's a I feel like the, do we I mean the pal merchants they don't really drop anything. I feel like meh. But I don't like that you attacking these land balls, so you all need to die. You too, especially you. Alright, nice. Do we get what do we get from land balls besides meat and wool? That is that it? I mean, checks out actually. Alright, whatever. Um oh. More rubies. Wait, well, we need to use our arrow, right? Okay. God, today, so I was in the gym this morning at like six. And at some point, these ladies, older ladies, they come running through the weightlifting room with these weird, like, bouncy shoes. Let me see if I could show you all, actually. Okay. I found it. It's this. <laughs> it's these things. They're called jumping shoes, I guess. Either way, it looks good because honestly, I feel like I need this shit because when I I can't run anymore because my knees and my I don't know I have joint problems. <laughs> they come they come running through the gym just like healing out everybody, running on these things. I was like, what the fuck? It was actually hilarious. It, it, I don't know. It made me laugh. I, I was like struggling through. Um, like girls or something like that. I was like laughing, laughing my ass off. It was great. Uh, I don't think we can. Yeah, we definitely can use chill out for this. Okay. Where are we going? We're supposed to be going north. Why are we capturing rubies? Well, whatever. We here. Might as well capture them. And we get a bunch of leather anyways. We need leather for the van, van womb saddle. Alright. Let's head north. Hey, a normal egg. A large common egg. What is, what is even in a large common egg? I don't even... I don't know. What? What did I miss? But yeah, have you all seen those? This is just like... This makes them like a good... Like half a foot taller. Uh, it was good times. Alright. Now that we have this copper key... Did any of these chests... Okay, this music is too old as well. These chests... We have chests marked on the map. I feel like they need silver keys, you know. I don't think I'm gonna go check, honestly. I'm pretty sure they need silver keys. There's a bunch of tugs across there. Meh. Can we do Mamarest to Mamarest? I think we will die because there's two of them and... They hit real hard. So... I don't think that's a good idea. Alright. Might as well see what we could find, right? Minus the distraction of these constant thugs everywhere. I'm hoping we could climb up this. It's gonna take a while. We could do it. Alright, this is I I actually don't think this is good because we're not even halfway up and we have less than half of our stamina. Wait, can we get into this little crevasse? Any little, this divot? Please? Yes, oh my god. We almost ran out of stamina. We would have fallen all the way back down, by the way. Alright, maybe maybe we could use this... Um... Wait, what? Wow, I actually slid past it. Who's attacking Longboy Drake? Right. Whatever. Let's see. Alright, we're supposed to be going north. There's a free pal alliance devouts across there. Level 25 done. There's a bunch of them. Oh, Mossanders. I want to catch one of those. Problem. Is that again, of course, we're playing on hard mode, right? There's two of them. And they're one is the same level as us. I feel like that will end up in disaster. I don't think that's a good idea. If we see one that's like level 20-ish, then yeah. But we will get clapped by these fucking grass pandas and I'm just not for it. La last time we got ruined by the, what were they called? Woolly poops? Woolly pops? Yeah. And those were only like level 17. So imagine the Masandas. Masandas will just hit you with a, just a giant slap to the face. Yeah, no thank you. 
Okay. Alright, you actually jumped decently high now. Did he always jump this high? Hmm. Feels like he's, he got more powerful somehow. Oh. Um, no. <laughs> Absolutely not. You know, they're chasing us. You know, all these things chasing us. Hmm. We definitely can't run away on Battle Beast, I can tell you that much. He is so fat and slow, which, you know, is great because he hits real hard. But I think, wait, are they fighting each other? Are they chasing us? Hell Zephyr. Maybe we. Maybe we want to ride one of these. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> it's a scary place. Before we fight, we really want to just find a fast teleport. Can we capture these? I don't think we can even capture these. We only have two gigaspheres. I just realized we should have made... We can make hyperspheres now. That's what we should have done. So yeah, let's just try to find a fast teleport somewhere here. We might be able to glide to one. You know why? Because you see how here is nice and hilly and elevated. Might be able to pull that off. The only thing is, I don't see any. I don't see any. Normally, you can, like, if you get close and the map reveals them, you could see them grayed out. But there's none to be found. How's that for again? There is a boss across here. Hmm. Oh, I see one over there. Alright, maybe we could do it. Alright, so we're gonna run up here. Slide down. Because we don't have a flying power, right? So. Oh, I see one. Alright, nice. Look, look how much distance we could cover just by doing that. So make sure like you get some to glide with. Especially yeah. Um Kilomari. Kilomari is only best pals, I find. Just just for this. Like look how far you could fly so quickly and easily. Alright, let's not actually hit the ground. There's loop ones. Can we fight these? I'm gonna try. Ow. Ah, uh, all right. Oof, oh shit. Okay, no, no, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. We died. <laughs> okay, so the answer to can we fight these is no. By the way, I didn't even realize it could hit that hard so quickly. Jesus fuck. All right, whatever. You know what? Mistakes were made. Let's sleep. Because cause they're dark types, right? So when we sleep, they will not be there, hopefully. I, hopefully they despawn, jeez. I don't want to deal with those monstrosities. Loop mons? Loop moons? I think it's loop moon, right? And we might as well put the pile spheres to be crafted. Is this a waste? Whatever. <laughs> Get 40 hyperspheres. I mean, it's not like we can make anything else. So, whatever. We might as well get the best spheres that we could. I think that is 100% the move. Okay. It's daytime. Where did we die? We, I, gob fins tooth. Those gob fins. Gob fin? I swear, gob, gob fin has to be the most aggressive pal you could encounter. Let's, let's uh, be a little bit careful around here. My hat. Oh shit. This is what? No. Nope. Nope. No, 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 no. Fuck that. There's like a hundred of them. All right. We could repair our hat. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I know about immediately. I'm not, I'm not for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My hat is damaged. I know. Is there, uh, there is no. We need a Anubis. An Anubis. Anubis. Hurry up and finish it in. Alright. Is he going? Some, I feel like somebody... Why are they just like running around in a circle? Alright. Well, we'll reset him. Come. I want you to make these hyperspheres. Also, I'm wondering, did we... What are we missing? We're missing. What? Okay, well, uh, mm. Excuse me. He's in the ground. What?
whatever. <laughs> this is <laughs> it works. I'm not gonna complain. Wow, he makes it so fast as my fuck. Let's just take this now. <clears throat> so what we're we missing? We're missing. There's something that we're missing for sure. Why are you crafting? And in terms of the van room saddle, we're missing fiber, alright? Did anybody make the fiber? Hopefully. Ideally. Alright, not gonna lose these this time. I just wanna bank whatever nonsense we have. Yeah, I'm just gonna throw this in here. Let's see if... Okay, he is making the fiber, right? Yes? No? No? Okay. Can you please... I can't pick him up. What? Guess what? We could just cancel this. Cool. We, honestly, I'm just gonna throw this wheat in here. It doesn't even matter that much. We have so much wheat. A little bit of degradation. A little bit of loss, whatever. Same thing for this. I don't care. Alright, he's making... He's making a fiber. I don't remember how much we needed, but... A lot. Same thing for ingots. God, yeah, this at some point really just becomes um crafting simulator. I mean I all for it, but <laughs> it does get a little bit painful sometimes. Don't worry, I will whatever painful crafting we have to do, if it takes too long, I'll definitely like skip it so you all don't have to actually sit through it. Okay, do we have enough fiber now? I hope the answer is yes. I didn't actually count how much we needed. So, hmm, we'll see. Really? We need six more? Whatever. Huh. God, yeah. So, the gym that I go to, there's so many, like, fit old people. I, you all know when you see, like, a fit old pussy and just, like, all right, what is your secret? You know? I feel like a lot of the time, so they're short, because realistically, tall people don't live that long. You know, if you're like six foot tall, you had you get you get all the advantage up front. <laughs> Once you hit like sixty, <laughs> shit starts to get a little bit hairy. You're like, mm, I don't see a lot of uh, sixty or like you know six foot four people walking around. Really, seems like we all just expire after a, little, a while. Like. God just like preloaded all your, your stats for the beginning of the game and then at the end so it's so it's all over that's how it feels but uh, you know hopefully hopefully i make it although well it starts for tall old black people i feel like i might be I don't, I don't know if that will go well um okay so we're here by these fucking murderers war sex is very cool by the way i wish we could actually Fight him, but we definitely can't fight him. We could maybe okay, we definitely can't fight you. Can we fight any of these? There problem is we take so much damage. We can fight Chillet again. Pen King. Maybe we could do Pen King now, you know. With Mamares, because Mamares could actually take out all of the pen gullets. Alright, let's try it and then we'll go. Maybe we'll try to go further not. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Press it. Press here. Alright. So, what we're gonna try to do, Mr. Mamaras, where is he? Battle Beast. Alright, so we will run in, jump on top of him, use Earth Impact on the pen gullets, take all of them out at the same time, and then we could actually fight the pen kings without getting murdered by these goddamn penguins. Alright, this is, this is the plan. We'll see how it goes. Because while we, ha we haven't actually died to them, we have almost died several times, and I'm tired of this shit. Need to be this boss. Alright. Can they all spawn in? Alright. Nice. They're all in one place. Alright, nice. We got them. We got we got all of them at the same time. Fucking Mama Rest, yes. Alright. This is... We can't stay on him. Okay. Alright. Battle Beast. Go. Cool. Matter of fact. I want to catch the Pen King, though. Let's see if we can catch him. 61% chance. 83%. Alright, we caught it. Okay, nice. Got him. And let's murder the next one. Alright. What I'm thinking to do, Eric. Right, don't, don't, don't hit him. I want to hit him one more time just to increase our chances a little bit. 
You know how much easier this is with Battle Beast? Battle Beast is a fucking boss. Yeah. Battle Beast, I love you. You're so cute. You know, scary. Get back in the pal get back in the pal sphere. Get back in the pal sphere. Okay. <laughs> ah, you piece of shit. Fuck you. Had all the penguin bullshit. Okay, nice. And the pen king has ferocious. That is actually real good. Alright. Finally, we could actually... <laughs> ah. It was so easy once we could actually take out the pen gullets without just getting murdered. Alright, did we get every... Oh, no, we didn't. Yeah, they, they, <laughs> they were like the bounced away. Alright. Wait, what? It's bugged. We can't even collect it. Whatever. God oh, damn it, Power World. Why are you like this? I mean, it is an early access game, so you can't bitch too much, but you can bitch a little bit. I want my rewards. Did we get the... Yeah, we got the Ancient Civilization Pass. Maybe we collected it and it's just showing the... You know, just the bags on the ground. I, ho I hope that's what happened. All right, we got a bunch of ice organs. Power fluids. All right, cool, 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 cool. Pen King Plume. So now we could farm the Pen Kings because we I think we need five for the Pen King hat. All right, well, we did good. And we could ride our Van, Van Womb is so much faster. All right, this is actually good. I want Van Womb. Okay, so he knows Ignis Blast. Air Cannon and Spirit. All right, whatever. That's fair enough. Maybe, do we have any skill fruits we could teach Van Womb? So I'm wondering, right? I mean, we could fly north from here. We haven't revealed this part of the map. Look at that, we did it. That was so that was so comical when we hit the pen gullets. Uh Alright, I mean, he's not that fast. Does does he have any good traits? He has brave 10% attack. Alright, well, we'll take it. Better than a negative one, right? Did we, did we catch all the crevices? Need two more. Look at that. There's two right here. Um, okay. 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 Wait, why did I use a... I wasted a hypersphere. Whatever. What did he use a regular... Well, he died? He's so weak. I mean, he was level 2, but still. Oh, also, we can increase our capture strength again now that we have this. I know we need a bunch of sparkets, that's why I'm just going to have lime here for a little bit. If you don't know lime in Caribbean, this means like hangout. So I might use that a lot. I'm, I don't know. I Because, you know. I have drastically changed how I speak just so that Canadians actually understand me. Sometimes I'll say something and I'll be like, wait, I don't think this person knows what I just said. So you really have to, obviously you have to code switch a little bit, right? You can't just use language that people don't understand. It doesn't really make sense. Are we going to catch him? Okay, nice. I'm going to get, why are you running away? Is it because I'm on a scary firebird? I mean, I would run away too. I hope he doesn't get one shot though. You got one shot. God damn it. I would have to jump off. Okay. But yeah, you know when you say something. I, I've been in this situation a lot where like I will say something to somebody and you could clearly tell that the bells are going off in their in their head and they'd be like, hmm, let me smile while I think about what this person just said. Yeah, that that happens a lot. So you have to, you know, you have to make sure you're saying what people Using words that people actually understand. You know, there's some people where, like, they use, like, a bunch of big words just for funsies. And it's like, dog, that's not... Like, you're not, you're not impressing anybody. I hate those types of people. Okay. Um... See? Is there... There's a lift monk effigy up there. We should go and get... We should go and get... But there's a chest here. Mm. All right, I guess the, the effigy makes more sense. There's a chest down here, too. I feel like the chests are too common. Or rather, too common isn't really what I want to say. It's just, <laughs> you see them so, they're so, they're really numerous. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like there should be less of them, but they should be more rewarding, you know? 
I'm pretty sure all these Vixies get one shots at this point, so we have to use our bull. It's fine because we have unlimited arrows at this point. Um, I like how they still hit hard. Oh, you know, we take the fort. Stop. Yep, gonna ruin my hat. Whatever. Trying to. Okay. I feel like. Sometimes this is this actually takes like a good amount of because you have like even through the pile it's kind of awkward. All right. Uh, I think we need two more Vixies. All right, we could we could do two more Vixies. Maybe we hit it with one little fireball here. Oh, we did. You know what? We should actually be using air cannon. Yeah, because air cannon has less. I think we'll hit hot less because it's a normal type attack, so it doesn't benefit from the stab piece same type attack bonus if you know that we don't know that term from pokemon but um yeah so i think the stab is like 20 percent where is the lift mark effigy i think it's up here right yeah i'll leave this dinosaur alone i mean we need to catch them but let's go and get the effigy but yeah stab is a 20 percent increased damage so make sure and you use the attack types that the pal has if you want to deal the most amount of damage i mean it's kind of cool though that you could put any attack on any pal so like you could you know mix and match like maybe i guess you could also cover your weaknesses right i think that also is a good move like for example van Wilhelm is a fire dark if its weaknesses are water dragon maybe you could put a what do you call it an electric and a dragon type attack on it and just in case you know in case you're in a bad matchup i feel like that is a good idea there's a lift monk effigy down there too all right well at this point this is lift monk effigy hunting <laughs> uh all right i mean i i, I actually want to explore like i actually want to go north all right yeah well then we should do it you know i'm saying it like i don't have complete agency <laughs> uh. Yeah, fucking YouTube does this thing sometimes where it just won't play the next video for some reason. Okay, what do we want? I feel like maybe we do attack. You know why? Because we are mounted all the time and the pals, when you're mounted, a lot of them actually add a multiplier to your attack, even though it doesn't explicitly say that. But that's what it does. Okay, <laughs> this one at least survived. Yeah, I keep forgetting I should probably be using air cannon. Yeah, I actually really like Van Wilm. Van Wilm, Van Wilm, you should be... Hmm. I'm trying to... We still haven't named him, though. Dark Phoenix. He could be Dark Phoenix, but... I mean, he doesn't really have a Phoenix vibe, does he? Okay, how about... Corporeal... Corporeal flames. Alright, corporeal flames. I like that. You know why? I feel like corporeal means like your material, right? I remember that word from RuneScape. Like the corporeal beast. I used to pronounce this game. This uh not game. This this word so wrong. I think I used to say corp corporeal. <laughs> like a fucking noob. But Oh, and ethereal. I used to say ethereal. I you know because when you you read a word. You just like you just you don't necessarily get the pronunciation correct and you might just go years and years without even knowing it until you hear somebody say it that's literally what happened to me i remember hearing the word ethereal for the first time i was like wait it's ethereal and not ethereal oh my god why did that that makes so much more sense you know it happens so i think we need one more premise right should probably get a little bit lower so we can get all the arrows on Okay, what well, does this one get one shot? Okay, well, I think we finished with Kremis now, right? Nice. This one has Workaholic. Wait, I'm supposed to be going north. Why am I going south? Alright, whatever. At this point, we should probably just, first of all, collect this egg. And we just teleport to somewhere else because I am getting very distracted. Corporeal flames. Dun dun dun. Right. Is that is this cave open? No. 
Is there any other boss we could do? We could try the King Packer, you know. Because we have our Catris. Yeah, fuck it. Nah, nah, we're gonna explore. I am not exploring here. <laughs> we will just die. Realistically. We could go north of here, mayhaps. Hmm. What else do we want to do? I mean, there's this area that we haven't explored yet. We'd go south of here. In my fact, let's just go south. I said we we're going to go north, but let's just go south. Not feeling to die again. Let's try to keep it to one death per video. I think that is the move. I'm like, what was the one where like, I just died back to back to back or something like that? That was embarrassing. Okay. Uh, you thugs need to go. Spirit fire. I missed somehow. Because I am a noob. Oh, yeah. Like, this is the shit I'm talking about. Like, in Pokemon, it would be so good. To Imagine riding a Moltres. That will be sick. Like, that's what you want, right? You don't want to just battle with them. You actually want to have them in the world. Apparently... A Pokemon like Legend, Ar Arceus, 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 whatever, it does this. But like, I don't, I don't know if you could ride them necessarily. But I know it kind of is what people wanted. But it was a shitty game. They, I, the fact that they have so much resources and they just never took advantage of it just blows my fucking mind. Yes. Well, I mean, if you're just making billions per year and you don't need to do shit, like, why would you change, right? Let's see what this Wandering Merchant has. He has hot things. All right. I mean, he has all the same stuff as the other merchant. It's, I really wish they had some sort of unique um, items, but they really don't. Maybe once we get to, an, oh yeah, once we get to a new area, I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. Yeah. So this place is hot. So we really need our different armor. Let's go back. All right. So I'll meet you all back here. Okay. So actually, instead of meeting you all back where we came from, from whence we came. Instead, we, I realize now we can actually make the, yeah, uh, what do you call it? Where is it? Where is it? The Giga Shield needs a production assembly line. So why don't we just make the production assembly line right now? I think that is 100% the move. And also, I mean, we have this pen kick, pen king caps schematic. I think we should just keep it on us just because it's a good reminder that we need to farm pen kings eventually now that we could actually kill them have all these meats all these eggs let's just turn this egg in here for now <laughs> uh, all right we need a bunch of fiber though thank you for making this i don't even know where our fiber keeps going we just keep running out of it somehow i mean obviously it's going somewhere but Okay, so we need to be a production assembly line. You know, it would have made way more sense to put this lengthwise. I feel like we just need more area. Here's what I'm going to put it here for now, but we will eventually change. Yeah, we definitely need to change where these are because this is a very inefficient use of space. Five seconds because of Anubis. That's insane. All right. So we can make the Giga Shield. And also, we should put a ton more power spheres to be made, realistically. One thing, though, I wonder... Can they even path to here? That might be a problem. You, you also have to consider if they can path to an area. Oh. Alright, everybody went to sleep, I guess. Okay. But at least now... We're gonna have a way bigger shield. So we won't get literally one shot. So maybe we could fight the stronger bosses with that shield as long as we dodge somewhat well. I think we might be fine. But we also need the heat resistant metal armor. Okay. All we need is ingots and we should be able to make it. With the production assembly line, I don't think we need this anymore. This bench. But we could keep it there for now, you know. Why not? Maybe I mean might as well have two benches, right? 
Oh, the Giga Shield is made. All right, nice. So we have the Giga Shield. So the Giga Shield is five Forte Shield compared to two sixty. Literally double. All right, that's insane. Um, what else do we need? The heat resistant metal armor. So we need to take these ingots. And we need to stick them in somewhere. That, that's an odd way to phrase that. Racing, as a uh, archer would say. If you all ever watch that show, that show is so good for at least for the first few seasons. Archer, if you um not Archie by the way, Archer show. This show, this show is so fucking funny for the first few. This is this is a good show to watch. High if you are into that sort of thing. I I, I don't know about drunk. I don't drink, but it's such a, <laughs> the jokes are. It is such a good show. Honestly, I'm just gonna say that. Like, there's probably some lines I could use for some like meme meme content at the beginning of the videos from the for the intros because honestly, this is just this is is very quotable. I will say that much. All right, so we got the heat resistant metal armor. So now we could actually go south. Also, there's no reason for us to have these eggs. I'm just gonna stick the egg in here. Who cares? All right. I almost feel like we need a large chest just for our armors, like not not these tiny ones. Or whatever. That is yeah, see, like we ran out of space already. Okay. We have the breads. We also need eggs. Okay. But the reason I'm not just taking all is because they actually weigh a significant amount, so. A little bit annoying. Alright, cool. So now we could go south. Oh, we're looking red and sexy too. Look at that. Okay. We were going this way, right? Yeah, cool. See if we could get a little bit into this warmer area. Okay. South. Corporeal Flames level only level 19 though. We need to do more bosses with him. I don't even know why I jumped off. I guess. You know. If we had Longboy Drake on, we don't actually need the heat armor. I realize because he'll keep us cool, but eh, not big deal. Really, I mean, we don't want to have to only have him out. That'd be a little bit annoying. Oh, the sweeper boss is right here. Honestly, let's just do the sweeper boss again. <laughs> Why not? Because right, right here is where we caught the Mamores last time, right? If you remember, we just run up to the sweepers. And the squeeze. Run up to the sweeper. God, we're so slow. Alright. And then, oof, impact. Look at that. He just hit them all at the same time. It's so, so good. I mean, I guess we should probably catch it. Seems like that would make sense. I mean, they're only level 11, so we actually hit them for a decent amount. I really wish, though, that Battle Beast had better cooldowns. I want, like, you know, you want lower cooldown. Oops. Lower cooldown attack, so you could actually spam one while the other ones are our own cooldown as well. I think that is, like, a good strategy. Alright. We could use this Gigasphere, I guess. We don't really need it. I like all these Swedes just ignore us entirely. Wait, what? Get back in the goddamn pile sphere, you piece of shit. Anyways. No need to be mad. They just want to be free. All right, low grade medical supply. All right, wow, we got so many ancient civilization parts. It's actually insane. Sixteen. So yeah, the double boss spawns, even though it's painful because we can't necessarily do all of them. It feels so good when you actually could because you get real plenty of ancient civilization parts. Burly mech, yeah, you sit down. Can't even do shit. All right, and corporeal flames leveled up. That's a good. What song is this? Oh, Celeste. I, yeah, these people, they make real good music. Hope you all enjoying the background music. I definitely am going to stick to just instrumentals because I don't, I don't... Personally, I do not like songs with lyrics when I'm like, you know, have some sort of entertainment on at the same time because all I could hear is the lyrics and then it's just, it's just too much stimuli. So we're going to stick to instrumentals. You know, we need, we definitely need, um, I don't know why I'm using a fire attack. 
Definitely need a bunch of power fluids. Remember, we always need power fluids. So anytime we see T-Funds, these poor T-Funds going to get farmed. All right. Well, listen, it's not my fault that you all drop power fluids. You need to blame Pocket Pier. If you don't know, Pocket Pier is the developer of this um, beautiful game. But we're really slow still. We, we're going to need to get up this ledge. Oh, level 23 bronze cherry. Can we do this? We're level 29 and we have a fi fire attack. And bronze cherry is only grass. Hmm. We might be able to do grape rush. You know why? Because grape rush has a bunch of fire attacks. But first, let's see how well Van Loom does. All right, 33. So he doesn't hit for shit. All right, cool. <laughs> All right, this is uh, this is a death angle. No, wait, no, no, that's the wrong one. Great brush, go. What? Why are you running up to me? What is this? Forty-five. Yeah, we do not hit these for. Why are you running at me? Stop. Yeah, they're trying to stomp us. <laughs> they're trying to snuff us out. Fuck that. Alright, we don't want to use the musket realistically. Although we did get but a bunch more ammo probably from the thugs that we kill. Alright, great brush. We count in on you. Okay, uh, the bow does nothing. Okay, it is actually better for me to just stand stand around than use the bow. At least the musket. Alright, 66. Yeah, we could definitely do them. We just need to not get hit. You remember, always go for headshots too. Oh, Great Brush is almost dead. Dog, stay away from me. Wait, why are we not just using Battle Beast? <laughs> Let's realize. I mean, Battle Beast is at least gonna. Ow. You are wow, that took away my entire shield already. We should probably fight with Battle Beast. Just trying to not. He's running at me. Uh, okay. Never. <laughs> I got hit for 1700. Uh, can we catch it? No. Way too strong still. Battle Beast is actually getting far. We, we should just focus down one. Alright, well, we have no ammo. If we get hit by literally anything, we're gonna die. So let's just keep kiting them. Battle Beast, that can't even hit. What are you doing? I... Um... <laughs> Can you... Let up? I don't think Corporeal Flames really hits them, you know? Ow. Would have died without that shield. I didn't even see the attacks from... Can you... Okay. 34% chance. We could probably do this. And also... We could probably capture him here. As long as nothing else attacks us, we might be fine. Okay, nice. We caught one. We didn't even need to get him that low. And Corporeal Flames went to level 22. He's actually going to deal some damage now. We, If we get a headshot off, we could do a good amount of damage. Basically, the Flames do percent HP damage. Actually, we keep attacking. <laughs> awesome. We, yeah, we'll cap catch a boat tonight. Holy shit, we got down to like 30 HP just now. That was, um, that was something else. Alright, we did. At least we caught them. Very nice. Precious Dragon Stone times two. It's not even a dragon type. Okay. Brown Cherry Meat. Hmm. But yeah, we have so many ancient civilization parts now. Did both? Okay, it's only the hat that got broken. Thank God. This shit is probably real expensive to repair. But you see how clutch the Giga Shield came in though? That was that was a, that was definitely a good purchase. We need to go south. Where am I going? At, well, hmm. Looking at the map. Yeah, no, we could go. We can go east, actually. East? I thought you said we. Okay. I'm gonna stop doing that. I. <laughs> it's just. One of my favorite lines from any show ever is just Patrick saying that shit. Uh, sp honestly, Spon SpongeBob is really just like a. a just a golden. Uh, what is the phrase? Like, just like a, a trophy of a show. More or less gets across the point I want to make. Yes, danger. Paolo, Paolo, do you really need to tell us danger the entire time? We get it. 
Um, I'm hoping there's a fast teleport somewhere here. It'll be Brawl Troll if there just isn't and we've just flown around this island. But at least, you know, exploring more of the map. Oh, there's a boss down there though. What boss is this? Hungry. Yeah, that bug is really annoying. I re they really need to eat while you're actually riding them because it's a little bit irritating. Okay, mama rest. Don't really, don't really want to deal with them. Although we could probably take on the mama rest at this point. Sealed realm of the esoteric Lunaris, level 32. Oh yeah, I really want to do this because I, I like the design of Lunaris. The only thing is, first of all, we don't have full health. Secondly, Let's see, what level is Grape Rush? Level 27. I think we need Grape Rush to get to at least level 30 before we do this. Lunaris is a normal type, so Grape Rush will be really good for it. But until we get to a higher level, I don't think that's a good idea. All right, first of all, I'm taking off this hat. But we could at least fly south and see if we get a fast teleport. There, there's no way there's not one, right? Yes, okay. See how it pops up on the map, even though we haven't actually activated it yet so the good thing we came this way so now we could actually get back to base in a reasonable amount of time i feel like there's so many kativas everywhere what is this about syndicate thugs shut the fuck up y'all can't do shit oh <laughs> i missed i might be able to hit both of them at the same time yeah, look at that. Icicle Cutter is such a good move, definitely. Use it if you um, haven't. Oh, where is it? Oh, it's all the way down here. I, we don't take fall damage, though, when we're on PAL, so... We just literally just jump off the ledge. Oh, there's a mercenary with a wounded knee. Doesn't look very mercenary. Oh, it's pretty rare to have some anyone come through here. You won't find anything interesting. The Syndicate took everything we had. If you can make pals phase, you can catch pals and surround yourself with bodyguards. <laughs> the law on this island is that the strong eat the weak. I'm so tired. There's nothing left for me. Here, let me give you some supplies, some of my supplies. They have almost no use left for me. This person has given up on fucking life. Five pallium fragments. All right, you know what, mercenary? Thank you. Looks more like, she looks more like a, um, uh, a very exhausted villager, but uh, apparently she was a mercenary. Yep. I ain't gonna question it. Okay, unlock this fast travel. Very good. So now we can come back here. We will eventually, we definitely want to do Lunaris, but we need to get, what is this? Oh, this is one of the sanctuaries. So this has really rare pals on it, but also it uh, is a crime to go to it and also to to step foot on it, to capture pals on it, to fucking breed on it. It is a crime, all right? So let's, we, uh, we definitely know we're near strong enough to actually go to those islands yet. Plus we can't fly that far, so. We would just end up dying. You know, we could probably glide though. But anyways, oh, let's check out our brown cherries. Those eggs are ready, I'm pretty sure. But let's check out our brown cherries. So, oh, the brown cherries have level three planting, eh? Helps carry supplies, increasing the player's max carrying capacity. That's actually very good. And then King of Fluff. <laughs> Wait, you could ride Sweeper? Hmm. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, maybe. I'm thinking we might want a sweeper for now. Conceited. Wait, Conceited is plus 10% work speed? I didn't even know that. He's actually a very good worker then, the sweeper. Alright. What else did we capture? That's interesting. Hmm. Wasn't there a pen king or two? Oh yeah, we have this ferocious pen king. While fighting together, fire pals drop more items while defeated. Alright, we need to remember that actually. And he has level 2 transporting. Maybe we could put a pen king at the other base, you know. But eh, we'll do that next time. One thing I want to do is check these eggs. See what is up. 
Okay, so large electric egg. Oh, we got Univolt. It used to be considered an emissary of the Thunder God and thus was not hunted by people. However, after witnesses observed one die from a lightning strike, its reverence faded. That's sad. Maybe we could ride a Univolt and <laughs> retire Chalette. Uh, God, there's so many pals. This one has a runner. Lombardrick. I feel like our time might be up. I feel like our time might be up. Logging Foreman on this one. It's really good though. Univolt is a very good design as well. Let me let me show you all it. Right. I don't wanna go without, you know, revealing the beauty that is Univolt. Let's see. This one, where's the runner one? Look at that. Fucking applies electric damage to the player's attacks while mounted. That is actually so good. Yeah, we're gonna we we we, we might we might bring back Chillette eventually, but let us play around with Univolt. What are we gonna name Univolt? Hmm. We could call him Sparky Stallion. I like I like that name, actually. Sparky Stallion. All right, we got we got a good name already. I'm happy with that. Let's see what level is the Univolt saddle. We just need a bunch of leather. God oh, damn it! How oh, we never have leather? What do you even make leather? Is it here? No, it is not. Maybe it is. I don't know where you make leather, honestly. Wait, can you even make leather? You might not. <laughs> might be. Might be forgetting. I'm pretty sure. You, yeah. Okay. Well. For us to get leather, where do we need to go? Do Tifons drop leather? I mean, at this point, we might as well just get a saddle, right? Who here drops one? Like Power fluids. Russia. Okay, so anything mama like. Not a Tifon, though. Rye Bunny, maybe? Where's Rye Bunny? Ah, really wish you could search this list. Yeah, Rye Bunny drops leather. Okay, nice. Alright, Spark is Talion. We're gonna do it together. Wait, Rye Bunny is a normal type. We should obviously just use a Great Brush. Duh. Because remember, Great Brush will increase the. Oof. That hit for 1800. <laughs> These poor red bunnies didn't even they just fucking chilling and all of a sudden this cat just comes out of nowhere and just bitch slap. Actually, you know. That would that would happen. Cats would hunt red bunnies. Although we didn't get We need like what five lead I think? Oh no, we need like ten. We'll probably see some down here, right? Yeah. Oh well those are cat tevas, never mind. Chicka peas. I feel like fox parks also. Drops leather. I mean, it's a fox. Where else would you get leather from? All right, fox, fox. You all, you all have got to go. I am sorry. I think we need a. We, this is a good time for a pen king, but obviously not gonna run all the way back just for a pen king. That's silly. Yeah. Who else will drop leather? There's a chest here. Hmm. Unibolt learned. Shockwave. Okay. Got another copper key. So I believe the copper keys are for the purple chest, right? Maybe? Or maybe it is for the red chest, but there's different level tiers of red chest. Because there's definitely a red chest that we came across that we needed um, a silver key for. I know, for, I know Kativa definitely just drops um seeds right so that's not anyone we want so you all are spared instead oh <laughs> around the stamina already what about dinosaur i don't know what dinosaur even drops i mean maybe let's let's see what they drop oh wow that actually hits so hard all right catch that one hit slap up this one all right cool let's see can you give me leather, please? Weed seed. Oh wait, they drop weed seeds. 
We need an uh we don't even really need wheat at this point, but that's good. I didn't even know that. <laughs> we went all the way to the B Emporium instead of just being here. What about you all? Do you all drop? Do you all do it? Oh, are you even being hit? No. I am using these attacks really poorly. Wait, do you all just drop um, mushrooms? Stop! Okay. Oh, right, bunny. Thank God. Okay. There has to be there has to be something we could farm for leather or something like that. Surely. Ouch. That looked like it hurt. Alright. Great brush, do your thing. <laughs> that is such a cool attack though. This is the way how the pull the, the darkness just like exudes from her. Him. It. Great brush. Alright, cool. We should have enough leather now, right? Surely. And that was a very good slide. Cool. Well, hopefully we can make the universe saddle now. Oh god, look how fast he could go. Easy. Nice. Okay. All we need is a Anubis. An Anubis from somewhere. Because yeah, you, you're gonna take forever. I mean, might as well. Well, this <laughs> this episode has been going for so long. I mean, yeah, the exploring is definitely the most fun by far. This game is just... I feel like you could just explore for... I really wish... The map is already gigantic. But imagine if the map was like RuneScape size. If you ever play RuneScape, that map is massive. You could just go on and on forever. But I mean, the map is kind of empty, so... Obviously, it's better if they fill it out. But okay, cool. We have our Sparky Stallion saddle. Okay. <laughs> That's not what we wanted. <laughs> Alright, no. Look, look, fucking majestic. Look at that shit. And we're so fast. All right, yeah, this was definitely a good upgrade. We are so much faster. The fact that we just got one with Runner just randomly is insane. And Zen Mind. I mean, 10% increase the neutral attack damage. I don't know if we really use a neutral attack, but it's better than nothing. So we have Spark Blast and we have Shockwave. So we want to put Spark Blast first and then Shockwave, and then we could put Sand Tornado. All right, cool. And before we go though, I want to see, do we have any cool attacks that we could stick on Sparky Stallion? Maybe, right? Let's see, we have Shadow Burst. Flare Storm, Seed Mine. Seed Mine is really, 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 really strong. So here's what. Who is he? I mean, we could put Seed Mine on Battle Beast, you know. That would make more sense. But this is more fun. So <laughs> Let's do Seed Mine. Cool. Because look at this. When you use Seed Mine, I don't know if you all paid attention when we got hit by Seed Mine. Or we didn't <laughs> dodge seed, seed Mine is really what I should say. But like, it shoots out so many seeds and like, they all hit. It takes a while. But if you're against a giant pal, they will all hit the pal. So you could end up doing a shit ton of damage. Alright, well, I didn't necessarily want to fight this fox box, but we're here. And we get the electric damage too. So look at it, it'll do the little effect. You see, it? they get sparks on them. Actually insane. Alright, cool. Leave me alone. I mean, I did attack you first, so... It's a little bit unfair for me to say leave me alone, but... You know, all fair, all is fair in love and war. Alright, with that... I will see you all next time, and until then, take care.